Hi everyone, my name is Martin and welcome to a new let's play of Kingdom Comes Deliverance. It's my 500th video and I thought to celebrate and put the webcam up for the first time. So, hi, how are you doing? Um, so we're going to do this full playthrough of the game. We're going to be a rogue stealthy character. Main uh, weapon will be archery, will be a bow and a short sword and board. That's the idea of the game. So, um, yeah, without further ado, let's get started. Let's start a new game. And let's do playline number three. I have some experience with the game, so I'm not going to go in blind. Well, husband, how goes it? Good. I should get it finished today. Where on earth is Henry? I need him to run some errands. He was still sleeping when I went out. At this hour? Blue-blooded idler. Well, it looks like he was out all evening, drinking like a lord. <laughs> Go and get the lazy bones up then. Quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm -hmm. Henry, get up now. There's work to be done. Get up or I'll come get you up, you slugger bed. Hear that? You'd better not vex him. Now get up quick. Your breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? Have you been... Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, it's nothing. It's just a scratch. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You'd better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. Oh, don't worry, it wasn't that. I, I just scratched myself, is all. Hmm. Well, just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Now get up, you rogue. state you're in this morning. What on earth did you get up to last night? Alright, let's get going. Right, so um, we can choose 
one of these four abilities, these talents, and I think a good thing to do is balance them out a little bit. I'm going for agility and strength. So I was dancing. I went dancing. Dancing? With Bianca. Ah, that's why you're tired. But you'll still have to work today. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not telling me. And it's connected with that scratch on your hand. And that suspicious looking character with a sword who turned up in town recently. Right, that must be, uh... <laughs> doesn't matter. So I'm learning to sword fight. And what of it? What harm does it do? At least I'll be able to defend myself. God above, Hal. You know how your father will react when he finds out. How? What's he gonna do? I'm doing nothing wrong. I just wanted to try it. On your own head be it, then. I can't stop you. And you can deal with your father on your own. Don't come looking to me for help. All right. So, um... The more we talk, the more we speech we get. So that's an important part of the game. So, um... Did Matthew and Fritz come looking for me? No, I haven't seen them this morning. They shouldn't be hard to find. They'll be hanging around a tavern somewhere, as usual. Mm-hmm. All right. Let's see. Matthew and Fritz aren't drunkards. I never said they were, did I? And if I really minded you going for a beer with them, I'd have put a stop to it long ago. I was young once, too, you know. And your father was no angel when he was in Kuttenberg. Of course he wasn't. <laughs> you don't believe me? Ask him yourself. All right, I will. You're not a boy anymore, Henry. You're a man, and it's time to start acting like one. Yesterday you promised your father you'd help at the forge. If you made yourself useful now and then, I wouldn't mind your mischief making so much. Can I get something to eat? I left some breakfast on the table. Help yourself. Right, good. His father angry with me for sleeping late. He's not happy. Yesterday you promised him you'd help finish that sword for Saratzik. He's not as young as he was. And you know how his joints pain him. He's too proud to complain, but he needs your help, Henry. I know. Don't worry, Ma. Of course I'll help him. Good. Well, he's such a good boy, He always has he? his knees ache when there's a storm coming. I hope oh, they're wrong this time. It's looking like such a nice day. Do you need me to do anything, Ma? Ah, you're a good lad. But I'm fine. It's your father needs helping with that sword. All right. That's enough. All right, so we're hungry first. So let's uh, let's eat. Let's see what Mum cooked up. We got a point in strength. All right, so how is our um, nourishment doing? 65. I can do a little bit better. So let's have some cheese. But this game, this my new found love, I can tell you that. So many people say it's like Skyrim 2, and I can relate. I know I've played over 2,000 hours of Skyrim, and um, yeah, it's very good. It's so good. But um, on the other hand, it's nothing like Skyrim. Oh, I want to have this porch. Hang on. Lentil soup, that's right. All right, I think that should do. Let's have a look in the box here. Need this stuff anyway, so might as well get it. Two of these, nice. All right, let's see. My microphone a little bit lower. There you go. Let's have some food. Get our nourishment up as close to 100 as I can. This cheese does 10. Okay, we can do this and we keep the lentil soup. Maybe it goes bad, but we'll see. All right, let's see. Uh, let's see, father. See if he's really pissed off or not. I like the fact that you can pretty much role play in this game like this. I like that. I like that a lot. So expected to see that more often, right? Oh, there he is. Come here. I need your help. At least you're up. That's a start. Anyway, we have a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money then. Yeah, that's the other thing. 
Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Kunesh? That drunkard? <laughs> That'll be fun. Well, you're a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails into his arse. Sure he'll be happy to hear it. Is that all? Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sasso. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now, work won't wait. Alright, now I'll try to switch on and off the camera in cutscenes, but if I manage it through the whole play of the round, then we'll see. Alright, so we have a few tasks to do. And one of the first tasks is to get axe and a hammer. Was it? Let's see. Um, collect the debt from Kunish. That's what we <coughs> need to do first. A little bastard. He's over here. Let's have a word with him. I think it's going to be a fight. Yeah. Uh, I don't think we have points already to spend. Um, well, actually, there's one in s no stats. That's main level, so many skills, it's so good. But um, nothing yet, nothing yet. So let's have a word with him. God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? He's the friendly type. My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer and nails. I've got nothing, clear off. You know you owe father for a lot more than just the axe and hammer. If he went to the bailiff about it, you'd be in deep water. At least pay for the tools if you can't pay for everything. I told you I have no coin, you bastard. Get the hell out of here, or I'll use the axe on you. Oh, really now? All right, so we have different options for speech and how to persuade someone. And uh, I think in this case, because he's a bastard, yeah. I must have misheard you. It sounded like you just told me to clear off. But you wouldn't be stupid enough to think you can steal not pay your debts and then try to scare me, would you? You son of a whore. How dare you speak to me like that? Didn't your thieving father teach you any manners? No? Well, I'll teach you then. Right. Well, Henry's pretty bad in everything, but he should be able to win this fight. I hope. <laughs> Backwards myself, but that's really so weird in this game. Go ahead and gather your strength. Damn. Ah! Bugger! Oh! Ah! Ah! He's a bastard. Why? Oh! There's nothing really which you can do if you get too close. There we go. A bit better. Well, we barely scratched them. One in. <laughs> oh! He's bad in blocking as well. Uh, we have to do better. Kurva Forget. fix. Kurva fix. Right, back up. Get our strength back. God. That's pretty good. <laughs> Is that the best you can do? <laughs> Ooh, I'm going down, I think. 
That's not good. Come on. Back, 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 back. Almost got him. Almost got him. Hold on. Almost, almost. There we go, yeah, we got him, nice. Enough, Close though. <laughs> I give up. I'm happy he didn't lose. Want. It's not much, but it's all I have. You understand? Yeah, give it to me, bastard. And bring that wood away so I can nick that axe. Can I just take this axe now? Oh, I can. All right. Before it's stealing, but now because I he gave me his key, you can freely go into his house and take everything. There we go. All right. Perfect. Nice. So, what is next on the list? We need to sell this because we need to buy coal and we don't have any money. Uh, one way of to get money is picking herbs. Um, if I'm going to do that, I probably will. I will be doing that offline. Um, I want to have herbalism at level 10. There's a special perk that increases every time you pick up a herb. You get 1 XP for strength. And it sounds little, but it's pretty good. Good health to you. And to you, sir. Alright, let's trade. So now what we can do is sell uh, this one and this one. And we sell the lentil soup as well. Who cares? And even though it's not much, uh, it's a good thing to haggle in this game. Uh, especially for your speech. So let's do that. Um, can we do something about the price? Sure, why not? I like it that you can do that as well. So um, we're just trying to get like... Maybe something like this. Don't want to get him too pissed off. Is this enough? Because I've blood all over that's my face much. and shirt. <laughs> what will it be today? Wait a moment. All right. Well, that's all we can get off. That's fine. Some Very well. I agree. Thank you. Okay. So now what we can do and bear. We have to buy bear. Ill, ill for my father. But we have to do it at the very last point. Um, else the bear gets cold. And then you have to get back and get the new ill. Uh, we can see Bianca again. Well, that's a good thing. <coughs> All right, so let's buy ten of these. There we go. I'm not gonna haggle on this one. It's just too little, too little money. Um, let's train the sword hey, fighting as well. Do you want have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? <laughs> oh, it was nothing. Except mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. No mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. True. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. I want to live and see the world. But the world's a dangerous place and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. And as it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So... Are you ready to get stuck in? Hell yeah. Yes. All right. I wait on the ground by the sheepfold as usual. God, the voice acting is so good in this game. All right, the sheepfold is right over here. We can pick a few herbs while he's he, because he's just slowly coming this way. So let's get some sage. Now, at first it's one by one, but soon you pick up a whole patch and it goes much much quicker and I will do some alchemy later on. Alchemy in the beginning is a little bit tough um, because brewing one potion takes quite a bit of time but there is there are two perks that eventually you can do it automatically and make one potion automatically and there's another perk 
where you do it automatically and you get three potions out. Oh no, it's pretty good. Right, he's almost here. Let's pick up a few more sage. Um, it sells reasonable, so. There's a lot of herbs to be had, especially nettle. There's like, if you really want, you can get level 10 in herbalism here in, in Skellige, no problem. And um, okay, for around 800 nettle of this stuff, it's so easy to get. It grows everywhere. All right, enough of that. Let's uh, let's do some sword fighting. So, can we get started? Oh, we can. We can. Good. And since today is the last time we'll be seeing each other, you can show me everything I've taught you so far. All right. Very well. Let's start with the basics. Remember that Henry's Keep pretty moving. bad and Your everything. Life depends on it. All right. Let's give it a try. I can't do anything yet. Right, press tap so we really focus in on them. All right, uh, all right. Now try to hit me. You have to put your weight into your attack. If you just fiddle around, you'll get nowhere. Try slashing from different sides. Unpredictability is the key. All right, Never repeat me. yourself. There we go. No? I can't stab yet. Great way to level up. All right. The point so. of the blade is for stabbing. Try it a few times. Good. Nah. Okay. Next. Good. Oh, I thought I already had it. Uh, now we have good, it. Good, good. Let's try something else. One strike, I can fend off without a sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As soon as you land one blow, follow it with another. All right, so I'll do... Ah! Right. Nice! Ah! And we're almost out of strength. That was a chain strike. Okay, cool. Good. Ah! again. Sweet. Very good. Excellent. Leveled up sword right. finding. That's Leveled enough. up strength. Pretty good. I don't know about you, but I'm tired of first. Alright, he's tired. Let's go. Let's continue the quest. Um we need to get pick up the cross guard. We do that last and so let's buy <coughs> ale first. Yeah. Although there's probably something coming in between. We'll see. Alright. You can't be serious, Deutsch. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. Had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Kutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts. Traitors. Now even the Pope God be with is you, Henry. To your king. I'm with you, so Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsch is spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the Empire! <laughs> what do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays not even the devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas' commander-in-chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. 
South Bohemia is with Sigismund and... don't and forget about Gutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but... Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words, exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson. Doesn't he, Fritz? You're too I Matthew. You should give him a proper hiding. <sighs> Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge pile of manure. You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'd rather torch it, to be honest. But, doing some tears all day. What do you say, Henry? But I was going to get ale for a father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Saratik's sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? Alright, we're going to throw some horse shit at the house, so I'll do oh, well. it. Father can wait a while. <laughs> My words exactly. I knew you wouldn't miss out on all the fun. Let's go. Alright. To follow these guys and throw some horse shit. I think it's this house here. Be a bit more careful. This guy li just lives next to the tavern. Yeah, it's freshly whitewashed. Looks better than all the other houses. It's typical German then as well, I think. <laughs> Gutenberg, man. Do you know what it means in Dutch? I'm not gonna translate that, but look it up. That's weird. All right. So are we doing this or not? Wait. We have to check that the coast is clear. Why? The Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go and lure her away somehow. Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. All right. Well. What do you want, lad? I just went by the tavern and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh, well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right and King Wenceslas is a drunkard, that sort of thing. Some people took exceptions, so I thought... God almighty! The fool! Next thing he'll start on about the Popes! He might have mentioned the Popes too. Thank you for telling me. I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight. So good. Alright, she's off. I have no clue where her son is, but it doesn't really matter. Um, well, he use. Oh, yeah. There you go. That music. Ooh, man. What are you waiting for, soldier? Fire the trebuchet! For king and country! For king and country, my ass. This is all good, clean, fun. <laughs> Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. Now that would be sweet. <laughs> That's for Sigismund! Woohoo! Eat shit, Dodgers! You bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? <laughs> hey, Hans, can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in a tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Oh, sons! I'll make those smites off your faces! Oh, I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Hanging out with this poxy Deutsche? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. Ha 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 
<laughs> Fuck her! I'll make you pay for that! Alright, there we go, man. Have a good old fist fight. Alright, let's go. Alright, now you're Already starts crying. Alright. That's the one that we're on under a level. Oh shit. Get this guy. Yeah. Did I hit the wrong one? Oh shit. Fuck that! There you go. Nice mine. Oh damn. Damn, he's got a serious beating. Oh, got that agility level. That's pretty good. Oh, shit, it's over. Run, you cowards! You need to run. This game is so different than any other game. Art style is fantastic. Open world. Sword fight is good. Archery is difficult. I'm not going to go to use the cheat that you can do in the command uh, from. Actually, you can do that right over here. Um, actually, I should set the FOV for this one. I forgot about it. There you go. That's much better. For archery, uh, the ridicule is switched off, and I will leave it like that. But I will tell you up front, and probably this is the only time I will tell that. I've got a little red dot on my monitor sticked on um, because it's just too difficult but um, yeah so that's my cheat on this one um, they say you get used to archery without a ridicule but I don't know man. it's it's pretty difficult all right so we're fleeing for the local police and I think we're going to get her somewhere. Maybe we can run up ahead. God be with you, Henry. Thank you. Somewhere around here. Can I have a wash? Oh, that was much better. Let's see. What is he doing? Oh, I thought he was standing there sleeping. It's pretty difficult, but still. I think we're gathering behind this house or shed. Damn, the art style so good, man. Pretty nice. Right. Are you serious? Oh, hi. Okay, so you don't have to do this quest, but well. Leveled up a little bit of agility. Oh, we sorted that Deutsch out. <laughs> that was pretty close, eh? That old bastard didn't stand a chance. True, but I'm worried that fucker Hans will snitch on us. Well, I'll let him. Then I'll snitch on him. And anyway, what can they do to us for throwing a bit of dung? Good point. It's not as if anyone really likes the Deutsch. It's a good thing your Hanko warned us. Well behaved girl like that. I'm surprised she didn't call the catch pole. She must have seen Matthias. What do you mean? Because he fancies her. And I think maybe she likes the look of him too. Hehehe. <laughs> Shut up, you idiot. Anyway, nice job at the Deutsches. Never a dull moment with you lot. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Next thing on the list is get the ill and then go back home. Yeah, it's a little bit laggy in this place. Fingered around um, with some graphical settings and yeah. I think there's a little bit of optimization that they can do. All right, let's have a word with Bianca and get our ill. There she is. God save, my lovely. You're looking well today. <laughs> you too, handsome. What brings mm. you here? You? Your beauty, of course. 
<laughs> oh, noble sir, I'm as honored as any simple maid can be. And apart from my beauty, what else might your worship desire? I need ale for father. A pitcher as usual? Aye. Bring me a cool one from the cellar. <laughs> but of course. Thanks, girl. Here you are. Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. Ooh. Out of the question. Here you go. And this evening I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I can't wait. Mm -hmm. Thanks. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. <laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty looking fellow was asking after you. Vanyak? I suppose. He's a man who makes his coin robbing honest wayfarers. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy when he's gone for good. But what he in heaven's name are you up to with him? He promised to teach me how to use a sword. What use would that be to you? Enough. You sound just like father. I'll be going now. See you this evening. Hal, I've got something special for you. Is that so? Now what would that be? Your favorite, Savior Schnapps. Hell yeah. Really? You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. You bet I will. All right, and save your snaps. That is what you need to save the game. No cheating. And there is a little kind of mod. It's just one file you can install and you can save what as often as you want. But I'm not going to do that. Um, so it, it will be alchemy. I will be making savory snaps. It's pretty easy. And you can buy the ingredients. Some belladonna and some uh, nettle. Yeah. And uh, yeah. So that's fine, and I don't mind it. It's like Fallout 4 if you play on survival. Uh, you have to find a bat in order to save the game, for example. It's, like, it's a little bit like this. The same here, if you sleep, you can save the game as well. All right, let's talk to these guys. Got be with you. I'm with you, Henry. How are you? I've just been to the tavern. The Deutsch was saying all kinds of shit about how Sigismund should be king. That bastard. One day he'll get his teeth knocked down his throat if he doesn't shut up. Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzig, and the Chamberlain has the crossguard and grip. Father had them engraved in Sassau. Right. They're here. The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. We looked them over. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. I can't wait to see the sword. Just make sure you don't botch it. When did I ever botch anything? Where shall I start? Ah, shut up and give me what I want, or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. Magnificent. Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. Well, I'd better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. You certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. Alright, so... Let's check. Go back to Father's Forge. Now, this is already a long episode, so what I'm going to do is save it over here. And we're going to continue next time. And yeah, we take it from there. So let's see. Let me show you how the save system works. Go to Savory Snaps, drink it, and we get game saved. Excellent. Everyone, thank you so much for watching. Uh, stay tuned for the next episode coming up very soon. I really love to hear what you think about the game. And uh, with that, have a good day. I will see you next time. Bye.